Hello, my name is Dewan Pore, and I am running to be the next ACS Poly Vice Chair. For more than 15 years, ACS Poly has been home base for me when I attend ACS national meetings. It's the meeting location I seek out first when the national meeting agenda is announced and where I make plans to meet up with science friends biannually. ACS Poly is also where I turn to for continuous education opportunities on a variety of topics. The level of excellence, professionalism, and member commitment of this division is second to none and is why I am beyond honored and humbled to be nominated to serve as vice chair of this distinguished body. As a prior member of the membership committee, I know firsthand the commitment ACS Poly has to not only servicing current members, but also in actively bringing new members into the fold. As someone who has greatly benefited from ACS Poly, I share this commitment and will actively seek to develop new initiatives with current and future members in mind. As examples, I plan to work to make ACS Poly more accessible by enabling more online programming and continuing education opportunities, as well as in developing initiatives that specifically seek to bridge the student to professional membership gap. Additionally, as polymer science continues to become an interdisciplinary science, this offers opportunities to strengthen collaborations with other divisions. As vice chair, I will actively seek to cultivate such interdivisional partnerships with hopes to develop more joint programming that accurately reflects the interdisciplinary nature of our field. I am excited and honored by the potential to serve the polymer community in this role, and I ask that you support me with your vote. Hi, Poly members. Uh, this is Tamunori Saito from Rockridge National Lab. I haven't been a Poly member for more than 15 years, uh, since the time of graduate school at Virginia Tech. Being Poly member significantly impacted my career. And I like all the members benefit from Poly. Uh, my vision as a vice chair is to be a great facilitator for Poly. I will support the chair as well as the operation of XCOM. Also, I like to uh, encourage Poly members to be more involved with Poly activities. Uh, we will continue all, all of the excellent activities we have in Poly, such as programming, workshop, a web shop, a webinars. Uh, I'd like to enhance collaboration with the other ACS divisions as well as, well as International Polymer Society. Uh, also, I'd like to create more opportunities. When I co-organized and moderated some of the poly webinars, I witnessed we had more than 500 or even 1,000 listeners. Uh, In-person activities are very important, but maybe we can start thinking about organizing interactive poly activities based on web. Uh, for example, we can do a career panel or focus topic discussions uh, in addition to, to some seminars. Uh, using web, more people can easily attend. I think the mixture of in-person meetings and utilizing web-based activities wisely uh, can be a good direction for Poly. Well, as a vice chair, I want to be easily reachable. Uh, Poly is run by excellent group of volunteers and your input for future Poly is crucial. Uh, please reach out to me. Uh, my email is saitot at onl.gov. Uh, thank you for your support. If you consider voting for me, that'd be great. Thank you. Hi, Poly members. I'm Kat Knauer, and I'm currently running for re-election as the member at large for the Poly Executive Committee. I have served as the member at large for the last three years, and during that time, I have focused most of my efforts on improving Poly engagement with our student membership base. This has included recruiting new student chapters, obtaining IPG funding for professional development of events for the students, as well as implementing new student-focused awards. And in the last three years of my tenure, I've been very, very happy to announce that we have welcomed three new student chapters with three more currently in the process of obtaining approval. If I am re-elected as the member at large for the Poly Division for 2022, my goal is to continue to support our student members as much as possible and increase their exposure and ownership within Poly. And I hope to do this within cooperation with our excellent staff in the Poly Business Office. And I plan to work diligently to recruit and retain Poly membership as well as increase the diversity and inclusion of our membership base. I believe that this can be achieved by focusing on schools with very diverse student bodies that are known for diversity and inclusion. 
for creating or also by creating more exposure and ownership for active student members within polystructure and getting them more involved and by providing more networking opportunities and professional development growth events outside of an ACS national meeting. And I just want to let everyone know I've built a really extensive network within academics, government lab, and industry, which I hope to use to build further interest in Poly and support our membership base and continue to serve as your elected member at large. Thank you so much for your support and please vote. Hello, my name is Carl Heider, and I'm a candidate for counselor in the Division of Polymer Chemistry. First and foremost, thank you to the nominating committee for the confidence you have shown in me by selecting me as a candidate for counselor. I am honored and humbled to be considered for this important role in the division. I've worked for over 30 years in the polymer industry with Covestro, and have also served a number of leadership roles within Poly and ACS. Through my service, I believe I have helped to move the needle in terms of developing programs and content that is of interest to our members, engagement of students and industrial members, and with diversity inclusion efforts. Rather than reiterate the details of that here, I encourage you to look at my candidate's statement where I've highlighted a few of those contributions. Instead, I'd like to focus here on the more personal side of what being a member and leader of poly means to me. I've been an ACS member since graduate school, which is longer ago than I care to admit. Like many others, I participated in meetings as a graduate student, but after joining industry, became far less active. In 2007, I took a new role where I was responsible for university-related sponsored research and philanthropic programs. I also work closely with our HR team to support student outreach and recruiting efforts. I recognize that re-engaging ACS, and specifically Poly, would be an effective vehicle to meet academics and students and become more familiar with polymer research activities at U.S. universities. I can't overemphasize what a great decision that turned out to be. After several years of enjoying the benefits of Poly membership, I was offered a leadership opportunity for the division through election as vice chair. Although challenging and a lot of hard work, I was delighted at how rewarding it was to give back to the community that I so enjoyed being a part of. Since that time, I've been active in one form or another in service to Poly and ACS. I'm continuously impressed by the openness of the community and the networking opportunities and how rewarding my experience with ACS and Poly has been. Now, perhaps, the opportunity has once again arisen to serve the members of Poly in the role as counselor. I understand the importance of this role to the division. 
in terms of representing our members' interests to the greater ACS. It is admittedly somewhat daunting, but I believe I have the skills and experience to do so effectively should the membership choose to elect me. Thank you very much for watching, and I wish Polly continued success. We are truly a community of which we all can be proud to be members. Thank you. My name is Laura Stratton. I'm honored to be nominated to be a candidate for an alternate counselor in the Division of Polymer Chemistry. Since joining Poly, I have felt welcomed and a part of this vibrant division that is dedicated to advancing polymer chemistry within the ACS and beyond. Service and volunteering in big and small ways is a part of my life. Alternate counselor is a support role and is ultimately there to serve you, the Poly member. Poly has great value in the workshops, travel grants, networking opportunities, technical programming, and professional development. As your alternate counselor, I will advance this opportunity to serve you on assigned committees that forward inclusivity, polymer education, and by reaching out to industrial polymer scientists who might not be aware of the benefits of poly. I'm especially excited about exploring additional paths to promote poly at the local and regional level, as well as increasing cross-divisional collaborations. Thank you for your consideration. Hi everyone, uh, my name is Yuan Simon. I am an as associate professor in the School of Polymer Science and Engineering at the University of Southern Mississippi, and I'm running for alternate counselor. Uh, I am uh, very happy to run uh, for the uh, Division of Polymer Chemistry it has played an integral part in my professional career uh, from my student days until now. And I'm really uh, happy to have an opportunity to assist our Poly Executive Committee in offering the best experience to our members. And I relish the opportunity uh, to help this uh, incredibly diverse and dynamic uh, division. So for the past 16 years, I've had the opportunity to participate in a number of uh, ACS uh, regional and, and national meetings uh, as a presenter, as a poster judge, as a panel participant, uh, and as a symposium and workshop organizer. And um, every step of the way, the uh, ACS uh, Poly Division has been um, incredibly helpful, and this has been incredibly rewarding. So consequently, uh, I want to continue to, to promote and strengthen all of the wonderful chances that are offered by our division, whether it is uh, networking, professional development, uh, education webinars, and of course, meetings. I think it's, it's essential to the health of our uh, community to continue to build bridges with international organizations and also strengthen the bonds between academia um, governmental organizations uh, and, and industry. I am also committed to bring to the forefront topics such as uh, diversity and mental health, um, which I think are critical to the well-being of our uh, community and our members. So I am really enthusiastic at the prospect of uh, uh, serving the Poly Division and its members. And I'm also um, really determined to uh, grow our community, and I count on your support to achieve these goals. Thank you very much, and I hope to see you all soon. Bye.